So it's Saturday today. Um, last day of garage sale in Minnesota for the week. So a lot of people are trying to sell their stuff, get rid of it. So they put up half price signs. But unfortunately, with that, means a lot of the good stuff is gone, and you see a lot of junk that no one really wants. So we're gonna follow the next sign. About to start our Apple Valley garage sale hunt. And this is just a reminder to please subscribe, tell your friends to subscribe, any family member, force them to subscribe. We need 1,000 subscribers. We have 48. We're almost there. So it's Saturday today. Um, last day of garage sale in Minnesota for the week. So a lot of people are trying to sell their stuff, get rid of it, so they put up half price signs. But unfortunately with that, means a lot of the good stuff is gone and you see a lot of junk that no one really wants. So we're going to follow the next sign. Stop here, there's two garage sales. The first one here. It's mostly big stuff so we won't be spending much time here. We're going to follow the sign to the next one. Father's Day is coming up. Some good yeah. ties here. Oh, those are some really nice ties for a box. <laughs> I don't need any ties. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Porkies. Buck of VHS. Austin Powers. This one here. 50 cents, but it's pretty faded, so I don't think I'd want to buy it and sell it because, yeah, the paint's coming off and stuff. Yes. <coughs> Always needed Titanic on VHS. Probably can watch most of these on YouTube okay, now. Ooh, this one's not a free box, this is a free crate of clothing in it. All free in here too. This is the VCR player we need for all those VHSs we're finding. Some free food at this one. Probably good stuff. On Saturdays, you see a lot of the half price garage sales. People want to move their stuff, makes for some good bargain hunting. Coke stuff, but glasses unfortunately don't sell well for me, so though I do like looking at them, I usually pass on them unless they're 10 cents. Let's see what these Corona glasses are here. How much are the Corona glasses? 50 cents, please. <laughs> Sold some Corona stuff lately, so I might be interested in those. 
Probably gonna pass on the Heineken mug. Beanie Babies, I don't sell them, but my son loves them, so I always look at them. If he was here, he'd make me pick out a few for him. I just want to point out <clears throat> this person is selling their award that actually has their name on it. Fifty cents bag. You got a karaoke machine? It's not karaoke. No. That's a stereo bed. Are there any? Are there any open right now? Not many so far. No. Yeah. People are waiting for the rain boy. More VHS tapes. Negotiate. Worry about sales. It's always a good movie. I don't know if you can hook those up anymore, can you? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't. How did you get it? Did you someone tear it off the phone or it just kind of ended up? My husband was in the telephone business. Oh, okay. And we were in North Dakota and they were closing on some of those and they said, hey, I'll take one of those. That's pretty cool. I think he looked it up online and it was like 200 bucks. It says 35 cents on it. I'll pay you that. Yeah, right. <laughs> For 35 cents, I wouldn't lift it out of there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Other co-collectors come by. Are you interested in buying or just... Buying, if it's... Right price. No cards? No, there's a newer I don't... Yeah. Right price and stuff. Yeah. Cause I have some more stuff that I didn't even put out. Like what? Um, Coca Cola lights. Um, like the Christmas lights and stuff. Yeah. I used to just hang them on a tree all year long. All right. Cause I used to decorate the Coca Cola. And then, do you know what these things are? No, I do not. So on the back of your um, trays, okay, they hang the magnetic, them. so you wouldn't have to put a hole in them to hang them, because that's how I sold all my trays. How much you got on this? Those are two bucks. If you're interested, I'll dig out the Coca-Cola stuff. Well, how much? Yeah, actually, I would be interested if you want to dig it out. Oh, a little house on the prairie books too. I used to love those. Yeah, is that something? Yeah, my brother here, Matt, owned them, and I destroyed one of his books, and he was so mad at me. And then a couple years later, he gave them to me for his birthday, oh. for my birth, for my birthday. Oh, great! Right. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to get a 
think they're six dollars. Yeah. A bucket. I'm gonna pass on the bucket. I like these. A lunch box. Even a Coca-Cola purse. Oh, oh that was really into it. That's kind of cool. I don't see those a lot. Actually, this is probably the most rare thing. It's a Coca-Cola book. All that's right. hundred dollars. Oh, geez. What's it from? Um, I can't remember. I think I paid fifty, and at the time I knew it was worth a hundred. Geez, that's awesome. And then some little tins, right. chip tray. Nineteen sixty. Yeah. That's a light switch cover. Some more little vehicles. How much you got on the little vehicles? I think three dollars. Got a pretty decent haul of Coke stuff today. Um, one thing, one garage sale in. Make sure you always ask them or tell them what you're looking for because they might have more stuff hidden away. She had two tubs more of Coke stuff she went digging through for me. So we found some stuff in there. Um, I paid $35 for all this. She knew what she was doing. It was a little bit more than I would like to pay. So my margins aren't going to be as great today. And I think this purse right here is pretty cool. This was $5. Um, I got to research it a little bit, but I'm guessing I can sell it for $15 or $20. These two little things, these little knickknacks, they sell pretty well. These are all $2 each. Uh, probably put $5 on them. This Coke clock, little car was $3. I'll probably get $8 for this. People like that kind of stuff. This little porcelain boxes here are 5 bucks each. I'll probably mark them for $10. And then I, got, I bought this set here, the three canisters. For ten dollars, uh, I might put twenty bucks on it. I might do a little research, see what they're selling for elsewhere, see if it could be worth a little bit more. We had a pretty good day garage selling today. Uh, thanks for coming with us. Remember to always take down your signs and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.